Oh, look, I just left from the views here. My bad, yo. We support you. <laughs> I promise you. <laughs> no, we don't have nothing against nobody. <laughs> you heard? We look at motion. <laughs> Yo, shout out to all the law guys in the world, you heard? LGBT gang, y'all dudes are lit right now on the internet. No Jumper Show supporting y'all like crazy. Yo, shout out to the No Jumper host and all that, bro. It's cool. Y'all dudes, are, that's the way y'all rock and that's the way you guys go. Hey, we support you guys. You guys are gay. Uh, you know, if 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 this guy, uh, DJ Academic, says support you guys too, we're going to support you, bro. You know, everybody just wrap the flag around your head. And come out tomorrow podcasting. You know what I'm saying? Adam, I mean, Academics has the pink weed for you guys. We doing it up. Nah, but shout out to everybody, bro. It's not a joke. It's not funny. But this person behind him is the same person. Listen good. This is the last place. I've seen him admit that he did something wrong and admit it just straight out like that. You feel me? He usually, he usually got to argue with you or give you some excuse or be like, oh, well, this is my brand. Like, you know, like, this is my company. I can... I don't, right, I can do whatever I want. want this to happen. Like I really don't think he wanted. I don't think he wanted that to happen. Like the way it did, bro. Now there's two things going really on here. Honest. Either that dude is in house phone's house, or that person is in your house. Academics and somebody needs to respond to this because they could be doing you the Nini two situation. So is that voice coming from your house, Ac? Nah, but it's coming from this microphone, bro. I know audio real good. It's coming from this. It's coming from somebody's house, but I think it's from house phone. That's on a house phone. That's not on a cellular phone. <laughs> he wanted this to happen. Right? Nobody got that. I don't see it in the chat. Like, yo, he's there with him now. Or oh, let's see. Maybe he puts him on. Hold on. Hey, bro. So and, I said, yo. and I had to sit and think about this. I had to sit, sit. Nah, that person is in the shadows, in the background, hiding. And he slipped up like, he wanted this to happen. Like, like, like you wanted it to happen too. You wanted, you don't think people are going to hear you. These microphones pick up everything. He wanted this to happen. You guys don't hear that, bro? Nah, tell me they, they cloud chasing, bro. They trolling. I didn't think about this the last couple of days, bro. Cause I'm like, I don't know. Like I, I'm nigga off the, off a perk. This nigga saying, but you know what? All these dudes are off of perks, but nobody says nothing to them. These kids are junkies. Like they talk about fentanyl. They talk about doing perks when they come to New York, all types of shit like that. But y'all dudes don't say nothing to them. You only say something to regular human beings that live in that 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 you think are not famous. Like literally, that's crazy. I don't see people high and be like, oh, that dude's on a perk. The only reason I got on a dude that does shows. Solo or whoever the dude's name is Is because he was claiming To be something at one point Of whatever I was doing back then So that's when I have a problem with it That you're every day on video high Other than that If you do something once in a blue I don't give a fuck Even if you high that day But you don't gotta come on tomorrow high again And the next day high again And the next day high again But nobody has a problem with, with, with Whoever's dick you're riding That they high It's kinda weird I'm reading the comments. I'm reading Reddit and shit like that. I was really starting to think, like, man, maybe this nigga did do this. Or like, you know, like, yeah, maybe this nigga did do this on purpose. Should have known this could have been. Let me ask a question again. The person is there, bro. Bro, hear this. The person is there, bro. Like, yeah, maybe this nigga did do this on purpose. Should have known this could have been. Let me ask and if that's not him, bro, your boy sounds suspect, bro. You around your suspect people. That's not AD. That's not Adam. That's not Java. That's not Paka. And that's not Saka. He's there, bro. Te están comiendo la nalgiviri now. At this moment. Really starting to think, like, man, maybe this nigga did do this. Or, like, you know? Like, yeah, maybe this nigga did do this on purpose. You should have known this could have been a Holy snap, bro. They Andrew Tayin this nigga right now. I have a question. Ask him one question. Wait, hold on. Right, right before that, uh, have you asked him why is this episode not fully deleted? For okay, views, it's an episode. You don't delete shit, shit, nigga. No deleting. Um, because nah. play, yeah, play this. We delete live streams if they're uh, destructive to communities. 
I try to get Adam on the phone. Adam right now is on the elliptical, my nigga. <laughs> okay? <laughs> this dude is a hater of Adam on the low, bro. Trust me, bro. Adam's, he's, he's, he's not good for Adam. And he, the sad part is he is Adam. But this is how academic feels. Academic feels tough. He found somebody that he could downplay and talk down to, like Adam. Adam is a sucker. Like, if I call the police, Adam is a super sucker. He looks at Adam like a super punk. Like, so academics is pussy, but he looks at Adam like...